Hi. When I was making my big RC for the printed RC tank, <coughs> many RC modelers from other countries asked me if I can make some video videos about uh, about this model, about uh, sizing because this is uh, bigger than standard side of this model, uh, about uh, motors etc etc. <coughs> So uh, it was. It is a little bit difficult for me because I am not native speaker uh, in English language, and uh, I am really bad in in uh, English language. How you can hear? So about the 34 for the printed about uh, 35 kilograms weight, almost completely for the printed. I will make a video <coughs> later when I will drive with that outside I must make some minor next changes here some details but this is working and I will make some overall video later but now I am starting a new project in same scale Tiger 1 uh, Tiger One Middle Production. So, I I will make and I am making a few videos in Czech language, but sometime I will make a short video with progress in English language, in English language, in my English language. So, take it or leave it. Yes, I know. It will be with uh, many mistakes in grammar, but uh, I will try that information. Informations will be will be there. So again, I, do, I will not make so many videos like in Czech language, but when I will uh, near some milestone in this construction, I will make a short. English video for our similars from other countries because uh, mm, I don't not many but a few our similars asked me about uh, details of these models because uh, you can download these tanks this or this or next tanks uh, from uh, Buy, buy and download data for 3D print from the pages. A link on this model is under this video. Uh, <coughs> constructor and author of these models is uh, Luboš Hort from Czech Republic, from Prague. So on this website you can buy and you can download data for print on actually any standard 3D printer. If it is Prusa or CR10 or Ender, this is not matter. Yes, you will print that on all standard printers. Not this. This is much bigger, but standard size. <coughs> standard size of this model or scale is one to ten. It means ten percent of real size. My models are bigger. Because I am a small seller of 3D printers, I have uh, many printers in uh, different uh, stages of testing before selling. So I use for these uh, large models my Modify Ender 5 Plus uh, printers with my different extruders and upgraded electronics at the Ceravit liner rails. I, I just selling these printers in uh, with, with uh, some changes, and on this uh, on this uh, big printers, I can of course print bigger RC models. So same like this T34, this Tiger One uh, is in scale mm, one to ten, like our original data uh, from Lubos Hort 
and this 1 to 10 I will upscale on 185 persons. It means uh, scale is about 1 to 5.7, something like that. Models are big and because of the size, this big and uh, heavy models, heavy models on uh, technology, on on 3D print. Of course, this size models, uh, which some models uh, will make from uh, wood or from metal, will be much heavier, hundreds of kilograms. But for example, this is standard PLA. Not all, this is PLA. This is ASA175, ASA some PG, but uh, main material is PLA. So this model is about 35 kilograms and when it uh, is moving in terrain it looks I think uh, really good because tank must be heavy, slow and uh, just uh, majestic. This model will be in same scale like T34, how I say. On this model I will use PET G or I am using PET G because PLA problem with temperature. This is big problem. Uh, I was uh, really careful about that, but still I have some uh, minor minor bending, minor um, heat disproportions here from uh, transportation in car in hot day. So my next model will be from PET G. Final weight of this model will be I think about 40 kilograms. About 40 kilograms. Uh, so what is really important to know if you want make this model bigger than our standard scale uh, scale ratio if you will scale the model depending on your printer size you have to count with many problems before you front of you mm, ball bearings when you will scale the model you you will not find exactly same ball bearings in same uh, sizes like uh, new dimensions after scale up yes so you must scale ball bearing sizes in your wanted scale ratio then you must find similar sizes ball bearings existing but new ball bearings will be a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller, etc. So, it depends on new sizes of ball bearings. You must just change upscale data, STL files, for new sizes, for new ball bearings. Yes. Uh, which software I will use for that uh, on shape? On shape is pretty good for changing uh, simple STL files uh, I just use on shape it is free for non-commercial uh, work so point one you must count with problems with ball bearings second motors uh, standard size uh, from Lubos Hort, uh, models from Lubos Hort are mainly designed for a motor something like uh, uh, 540, 500 or five, 540 motors. Uh, of course, on these big models, we need bigger motors, uh, bigger uh, speed regulators, and of course, much expensive more expensive than uh, uh, small motors, brushed motors. 
Uh, on T34, I am using uh, big motors, brushless motors for RC helicopters. Uh, two motors, about two kilowatts each. Here I have uh, almost one kilogram motor uh, by Gropner, about 1.5 to 3 kilowatts, really big motor. And of course on the other side will be other. Why so big motor? Because we need uh, that motor uh, will be, uh, we want cold motor because inside this model uh, ventilation or circulation of air is really not very good and in hot days we need a motor almost cold. So when this big motor will run on uh, for example 300 watts it will be almost cold. So again after scale up you need count with uh, bigger motors again ball bearings when it is uh, uh, this part with belts belts again you will scale up model but belts you need uh, change for other existing or like me you can print these belts from uh, flex material this is polyflex hf and i will add here uh, next layer of uh, textile cord for uh, size uh, for right size next 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 servos again you will scale up models you need find similar ser uh, servo for for turret rotation and uh, turret angle you need find a similar size of uh, servo and again change or edit STL files for new size of servos. Now I have a front part of of uh, hull. I have this uh, gearbox. Second is uh, almost done. Uh, next. I will make next parts of hull. I am printing. I am printing next parts here. Each part in uh, this uh, numbers of layers and infill size is, uh, for example, this part almost one kilogram of PDG. Uh, two days of print. This two part, day and half, day and half, 65 grams each. This part, 16 hours. This part, 7 hours. Uh, this gear, about one day each, maybe more. I don't know exactly because this is from more parts. Here we can see some tests of... Uh, colors uh, which I will apply on on this tank. Here I have tracks cells cells for tracks. Again my cells my tracks are uh, after some modification by me for Axis from M3 60 M360 screws. Total weight of tracks of both together will be about 10 kilograms. Now it is about 7 kilograms, but still some some cells are missing. Here or under five are next cells printed right now uh, material asa 275 yes. this is easy 
printable material on uh, open printers. This is again one of, of uh, printers which I sell here in Czech Republic. Ender 5, completely other electronic, my custom construction extruder version 5 with orbiter extruder e3d hot end so tracks so now i will show you a short test uh, of this gearbox and this motor on two cell and i think this will be for now all This uh, gearbox is very silent. T34 has a gearbox, planetary gearbox, which is very loud and it makes a really uh, nice sound for tank. But this gearbox is very silent and I will must make, I will have to make some sound generator, maybe only mechanical or just electro, some sound module electronic sound module. I don't know now. Maximum speed of this model will be not very high, but uh, I prefer more slow and majestic movement of heavy tank. But if I will want uh, more speed I will change, I can change uh, battery for 4 cell. Now it is 2, two cell, I will change, I can change it for 4 cell. So, for now that is all. Again, sorry for my English. And just take it or leave it and again link for this nice models in standard scale not in this big scale but in standard scale 1 to 10 a link for these models you will find in video description under this video this is not my e shop with this data author of this model is my friend but this is not my e shop yeah so Every communication about buying and about building of these models in standard scale, please ask Lubos Hort, owner of this uh, original data and of this uh, project and a show. So, thank you for watching, have a nice day and tell me if you want to see more details later from this big RC 3D printed uh, Tiger One mid-production RC tank. Have a nice day.